Hello YouTube, this is QS for Question, bringing an update to the EasyVid video. Uh, there have been a lot of questions recently about how do you record with audio, get the gameplay audio, etc, etc. Um, I'm here with this introduction to try and answer that. Uh, first off, you must, uh, you must have version 0.9.3.0 to run the tutorial as I show it. Uh, that is in the link below, I've checked it out, it does work. Uh, recent versions will not work with this. I've tried the recent versions and they are a pain to install. Um, the older version that I was working with is fine. It's stable. I really don't find a difference between the new one and the old one. As far as performance, it works. Alright. To explain the video, I must tell you that what I was first doing was I didn't show really exactly how I was going to set my recording up. So what I do is I open up the EasyVid, I click New Project, start a new project fresh so I don't have to mess with anything. Um, from there I'll go uh, record with Advanced Setting menu and two options, or actually rather three, to record with just gameplay audio. If you just want to record gameplay audio, make sure nothing is checked. Leave The only thing I would say you can check would be the uh, Transparent menu and you can also select um, an area you want to record. But as just in, for most people who really don't care so much if it's as full windowed as possible, uh, nothing checked is good. Um, if you want to record with commentary, make sure you click the uh, microphone button. And as far as I know, headsets don't work. It crashes the uh, program. I don't know why. Um, I've tried different setups. It doesn't work for me. So, um, just try if you have a laptop that's perfect for it but otherwise uh, I'd record with another device and just plug that audio in um, if it doesn't work and if that's if you want live commentary you press the uh, microphone button and uh, if you want a webcam a face cam you can press the webcam button and I'll lock that up for you uh, and then from there I'll I would click um, start recording with those advanced settings um, and I'd record as normal when I feel like I'm done or I just want to take a break, I press the pause button. Um, after you pause it and the record button comes back up, like you were going to start up again, you would go then uh, from the documents into EasyVid folder. You can go to EasyVid. Right in the EasyVid folder, right in the beginning, there's a .avi. It's a screen cap zero file. Screen cap uh, zero .avi. Um, that file can be opened up that has all the gameplay and such in it. That has nothing to do with your voice. If you're recording no voice, that's all you need. And from there, you can drag and drop. Um, I would recommend checking it to confirm that is okay. So you just don't drag and be like, oh, crap, it's worthless. Um, but you can check it. I, don't, I use Windows Media Player on that. You can put it into any uh, video editing program you want. Um, from there, if you recorded commentary, you go into your uh, projects folder and the number that it corresponds to for the uh, uh, video recording and you take your .wav file. Now I would never move it unless you're finally finished. Okay, That means that you've moved all your uh, .avi files out because if you do not move them or copy them to someplace else, once you press that stop button to make your final audio from your voice uh, be finalized, if you do not drag it it will process that you will lose the gameplay audio forever. So I highly recommend you drag it and don't worry about it too much. Um, and then when you are done, you can press stop. And what it'll do is it'll think, it'll just, it, it automatically tries to do it from the uh, folder, but that's it. It won't go anywhere else. It'll be like, oh, I cannot recognize this, so I'm just not going to do anything. Um, and that's basically it. Uh, you just drag and drop. It's really easy. I think I may have made it a little bit more complicated. Um, but thanks for watching the video. If you have any comments about it, go ahead and put them in there. Um, like the video. Favorite it for reference. Um, there is an annotation that will lead you directly to when I start um, my tutorial about uh, what I was doing. And um, I much appreciate your uh, views. So thanks for watching. Have a great day.